Hey, it's your girl Jazzy K from Super Tight TV. We want to thank everyone who's been watching and subscribing. And if you enjoy this content, please hit the notification bell so you can be notified every time we drop a new video. You're not tuned in to something super tight. Puffin' something sticky, nigga, I roll through the light Need to hear something real just to get me through the night I'm looking for them jackets cause I know they looking shy No, I'ma get some game tuned in with super tight Yeah, I get the low love from Big Bobo From the front seat, not no photos hey. Already, baby, what it do is your big dog Bobo Luciano I want to thank everybody again for tuning in to Super Tight TV. We back. Up your back going smack, smack, smack like we always do. And it's real good, too. Say, I got my sexy ass, gorgeous, beautiful wife. It's your girl, Jazzy K. We in the building like we always are. Tonight, I got a seriously super tight guest for y'all. Man. Man, I'm excited tonight. This man got good lineage. Yeah, good stock. Good stock. Mm -hmm. He came from some good peoples, you yeah. know what I'm talking about? Got a little squeaky mac and you didn't sprinkle in there. Yeah, some real ones. I'm talking about little Maurice Mac squeak, squeak, sprinkled in there. I'm talking about mm -hmm. got a little Gunna Measy sprinkled in there. Yeah, got a little, little, little boss lady. Got a little boss lady sprinkled all yeah. over him. I see it in it. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> got good stock, man. Y'all might have noticed this man from a viral moment. From a couple of months, maybe a month ago. Mm -hmm. But he set the internet on fire. First time I saw it, I said, what the what? Right. Ain't that how y'all said? What the what? I said, this guy here's got some, some, he got bars. Man. I was about to tell my agent, say he got skills. He got bars because he snapped on them. You know what I'm talking about? Y'all might have seen him on the famous animal, Freestyle. He might have been a, the youngest member I've ever seen on Famous Animal. Shout out to Famous Animal. I think so. Shout out Famous Animal. I haven't seen nobody this young snap like this in a long time. I got my man Dizzy in the building. Yeah. Give it up. Y'all might sit down. Sit down, everybody. Sit down. Sit down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Standing ovation. You, you star, bro. How you doing, bro? Good. You good? You shiny? Got gotcha. you. Yeah, bling bling on. I'm not gonna talk about that hat just just right now. Ah yes. <laughs> First, I thought it was Desoto Eagles. I said he representing the state champions. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I was gonna give you the benefit of the doubt. Mm. But no, nah, it wasn't the Desoto Eagles. Sorry. So we're gonna talk about those Eagles in a minute. All right. I'm gonna let you make it. We're gonna let you make it. But you know, back in the day <laughs> when we were young, there's a there's a uh, a theater in Harlem, New York. It's called the Apollo Theater. Famous, famous. A lot of stars perform there. You heard of Steve Harvey before? No. You never heard of Steve Harvey? No. Well, Steve Harvey, you seen him do with the big mustache. You ever watch Family Feud? Family Feud? Steve Harvey Morning Show? No, Steve Harvey. No. That's all right. That's all right. You don't know him. Well, he used to be the host on there, right? And when you come on, there's a piece of wood, a stump, right? It's called, you know, the uh, sacrum. I don't know. They sacrifice on the Apollo what, stump. The Apollo stump, whatever. They they rub it for good luck. You know what I mean? We have our own stump here at Super Tight TV, and I'm gonna need you to rub that star right there for me, please. Because that's the Dallas Cowboy star, yes. and I needed your energy on that. I appreciate that, Dizzy. Yeah, got me another victim. I got me another victim. How you do? So, since we've got that out the way, tell us a little about. Well, you know what? You got a sister over there, right? Yeah. Mama, mom, and daddy tell you, girls and ladies first. Yes. Okay, that's that. That's a golden rule in life. You'll go far opening doors for women, letting women go first. All right. Yeah, you will. So, I'm gonna let my wife get this thing started. All right. Yeah. All right. All right, Dizzy. What's up? Why don't you tell everybody where you're from? I'm from uh, like Fort Worth. Okay. Oh, you from Fort Worth? Okay, Funky Town. Okay, 
love. Yeah. What's what uh what school? Can he tell his school? Uh Y'all wanna Nah, nah, nah we ain't gonna do that year. Yeah. What, yeah. what grade you in? Fifth. It's great. You in the fifth grade? Big boy. Already. So uh What's your favorite subject? Uh math. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, you good with math? Yeah, gotta be, right? What y'all studying right now? You remember? Uh review. Okay. Okay. And um your grades are good? Yeah. yeah that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. So what made you pick up the pen and start falling in love with rap? First time I went to the studio, I wanted to rap. The first time? How old were you at that time? Ten. Oh, so you knew with it. And you're ten now. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. So you're a natural. Sound like somebody (laughs) else. Yeah. (laughs) So you had to have had been looking at some type of rapper or something in the past. You told me you like little baby, right? Who else do you like? Who who were you trying to, you know, who did you use to motivate you? Should I say? Mm. Who's some of your favorite rappers throughout? And you say, man, I like them. I can do that. Little baby. Little baby was the one, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's he's a good. He's fine. Yeah, he's fire. He's a he's a good target to try to shoot for. You know what I mean? Absolutely. And 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 when you went to the studio with your, how many times you been to the studio with your pops? Four. Four times. Yeah. So in the first time you went, you uh, you just wanted to get down with it, huh? So what did you do? Did you tell your dad? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what did he say? He said, he said, all right. Really? Just right off the rip. Like, all right, I'm I'm cool with it. Yeah. What did mom say? She wasn't there. She wasn't there, but no, 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 no. I mean oh. I mean when you first told her, what did what did she say to you? Was she scared? Did she try to just tell you, nah, I don't want you to be no rapper, you need to stay in school? Or did she say something like, Oh wow, go for it? Yeah. Which one? Yeah. The, the second one? Go second. for it? I read it. Yeah, that's what she said. Up. Go for it. I read. It. So you got some encouraging parents, right? They're in your corner. Yeah. I read. It. And mom is your manager. Yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. Keep it in the family. So, what's your favorite thing about doing music? Just rapping. Just rapping. Just period. Rapping. Huh? Are you a writer, or do you just, or you just, uh, just go in the, in the booth and start spitting? Rapid, kind of both. Like, oh, really? Ooh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's good. I was talking to um, you know who Maurice Mack is, right? No. Yes. Yeah, you do. What y'all Squeaky. call it? No, pops. pops. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, he was here, and I was telling him a story about when I first met Mister Gunnamizi and your mom, right? I said, man, first time I met him, he was here mumbling to himself. Mm-hmm. He said, but I knew what he was doing. I knew because I seen other people do it. He said, well, you know what he was doing, right? He was writing a song. I said, I know he was rapping. <laughs> but he was just mild in it. That's that's a serious rapper. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So what I'm doing is trying to encourage you to kind of look at dad. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Take it a little serious. No, take it a lot serious. Because if you take it really, really, really serious, that chain that's on your neck, that's just the start. You can buy mom a house, buy mom a car. You know what I'm talking about? Things like that. The sky's the limit. Absolutely. And I'm encouraging you to keep being positive and keep doing your thing. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because I like that rap you kick. You think you might want to rap for us today? Yeah. Oh, that's what I like to hear. Uh So let me ask you a question. Since you did that, how the girls been treating you? Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Did how many how many girls have you shown? Did you show a lot of people at yeah. school? I read it. So they're giving you a good good feeling. They're giving you good reviews about it. Mm-hmm. I read it. So they're encouraging you too. So I want you to just work on because you got a lot of people that's that that's riding with you. You know what I mean? Yeah. We don't want to let nobody down. Got to keep the grades up. Got to act good in school. Listen to your parents. Whatever they say, do. Might sound corny, but you got to pay attention to them, okay? You know what I'm saying? Because they're gonna, they've are gonna they already been where you are, 
right? And I want to hear some of those skills you got. Let me see if my sound man is ready for you, all right? I mean, do we need to start it over? Can you hear it? Yeah. All right. Ready to go. Dizzy. Uh oh. Big dog. I'm gonna step back, I'll do the race. I'll put it all in your face. Straight out of class, straight to that cake. I'm getting paid today. She followed my drip, but she's looking to play. Baby girl, get out my face. Straight out of class, straight to that cake. I'm getting paid today. Yo, my name is I'm really with it. Yo, yo, you already know I'm handling my business. Yo, yo, turn up on the music and give me a meal. Yo, yo, they watching my game because I'm in the building. Uh, I'm in the sky pack, I do the race, I put it all in your face. Try out of class, straight to the cake, I'm getting paid today. She follow my dream, but she don't get a play. Baby, I'll get out of my face. Try out of class, straight to the cake, I'm getting paid today. Man, she follow my drip. Get out of my face. Man. Man, I'm getting paid today. Straight I like that, class, baby. Straight to the hey. cake. So okay, we, straight out of class, straight to the cake. Straight to the cake. That's what I'm talking about. You getting paid today? Yeah. You about that money, ain't you? <laughs> <laughs> I like you, man. So, what's next for you? What, what you got planned? What's the next moves? Start a studio. More studio. You working on the album? Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, that's what I'm talking about. So, uh, how many songs have you gotten recorded? Two. You got two good songs recorded. Okay. What's the name of the second song? Dizzy. Oh, what about me? You're talking about, nah, you're talking about, uh, it's what about me and uh, Shrek, uh, Get Paid Today, right? Yeah, Get Paid Today is my favorite. I like yeah. that one. Yeah, that's the Straight to the cake. That's motivational right there. Straight out of class, straight to the cake. I'm getting paid today. Yeah, I like that. Hey, hey my little girl. Shout out Elise. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, yeah, Daisy. We have to have you shout out Elise. Yeah, you, that's you, her song, too. Yeah, I need to get an autograph for my baby before you leave. Like, <laughs> she, she, She's a dizzy Fan. Yeah. The reason I say fan, I don't like the word fan, and I'm not no one's fan because fan is is short for a word called fanatic. I'm nobody's fanatic, but I'll be a huge supporter of your baby. Already. All the way to the top. I'm gonna follow you. All right. And this is your first interview. Oh wow! Super tight exclusive. Super tight exclusive right there. So you have to come back when you get ready to drop your album and get ready to promote. Mm hmm. Yeah. So, so now I'm gonna talk to you about something else. I'm gonna talk to you about that hat you got on. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you ready to talk about it? We, we, we said we was gonna talk about it, right? Yeah. So, <laughs> you from Fort Worth? You said right? I think that's in Texas. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Come on now. That's in Texas. Dizzy, don't let them handle you, Dizzy. Get on. It. <laughs> Dizzy, don't break that ice. Come on, Dizzy. Come on. Don't, Come on. don't let them handle you. Come on, Dizzy. All right. All right. Don't give it to him. What make you pick our arch rivals? Mm, I just like them. You like the color of the uniform? You like a certain player? What you like? <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm getting it out of me. I'm getting it. <laughs> Which one you like? You like a certain player? Who you like? Jalen Hurts? Yeah. He's soft. He's soft. You think he ain't soft? You think he's a good player? Yeah. Now, I'm a, I'm a Jalen Hurst fan because he's actually from Texas. You do know that, right? Yeah. Straight from Houston, Texas. And I'm going to support him, especially because he's a brother. Yeah. I'm not going to talk about none of them players, man. Straight I'm just like playing. That. But I do not like the Philadelphia Eagles. That's one of our arch rivals. Yeah. So, who y'all play this week? Oh, oh, y'all don't play nobody this week, right? Mm -hmm. Y'all yeah, get what's called, you know what a bye means? That, no. means? that means they get to just sit back and chill. They get to rest and get the, you know, whatever injuries they got, they get to work on the injuries. So hopefully by the next week, they're fresh. Because mm -hmm. they're going to have to be fresh. Because you know who they meet the next week? Cowboys. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Yeah, boy. That's it's going right. to be a little bump in the road we'll for have them. Have us some eagle wings. Yeah, we're going to have us some good old barbecued eagle wings. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? What make you dislike the Cowboys? That's the question at hand. The Cowboys good, it just 
You don't like them? No, they good. It's just that's just not his team. Why is it not? Not his number one. Why is it not your team? You don't believe in following the team just because you're from there? Oh. Hey, stay this. like that. This, it is, it is, it is, it is. You hurt my heart. Are we really trash? Are we really trash? Wait a minute, man. Wait a minute, man. We got some people in the audience that's talking about Philadelphia number one in the division. Mm-hmm. Barely. Mm-hmm. And I'm telling y'all like this. We are America's team. That's right. It's a reason why they call us America's team. I mean, they said in the last two years, Mike McCarthy and the Dallas Cowboys have won 24 games. Only team that is more than the Dallas Cowboys is... Kansas City Chiefs and your Buffalo Bills. Now, if y'all gonna put them on that higher platform, y'all need to put the Cowboys up there. Is Buffalo a good team? Mm-hmm. Is Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs a good team? Yes. Well, what about the Cowboys? Are they better than Philly? No. Oh damn! I almost had him. <laughs> I almost had him, Gunner. What y'all? Breaking news. Super tight exclusive. Mm-hmm. I'm sitting here with a mega star. I'm talking about somebody that went viral. Is this is this the famous animal? Yeah, that's the famous yeah. animal. Yeah, it's, it's, it's on a different platform. It don't matter. So this is just one of the platforms. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh man, uh-huh. this one is only four. This one is I said only. This one is four hundred and seventy three thousand. You know what that means? If these were records, you'd almost be gold. But this is just one platform. This is just one platform. I'm, I guarantee you, when you add up all the platforms, you pass go. You might be plat. You sitting there plat. Uh oh, that's major for your first time being on a, any kind of platform, bro. Yeah, it is. I want. Hey man, hit my hit my thing for me. That's what I'm. Congratulations, How many brothers and sisters you got? Seven. You got seven brothers and sisters. Where you fall? You you the oldest, you the youngest, you in the middle? Middle. You the middle child. Or you the one that's you play sports, you do anything like that? Football. You play oh, oh now we talking. Okay. All right, what what position you play? Uh, outside linebacker and uh, wide receiver. I'm a running back. Oh, you play running back. Oh, which one you like better? The defense, the linebacker, or the offense running back? Offense. Oh, you want to be the running back. Mm. Okay. That's good. That's good. That, that's a good famous position when you when you're young. Yeah, it is. But that linebacker position, oh man, they get paid, man. <laughs> they get paid, man. Indeed. Which one you like better, football or rap? Rap. You like rap better? Why? Mm-hmm. Um, I um. Hmm. Hmm. I like rap better because it's more easier. It's more easier. Already. It's, in other words, it's easier for you to do because you're a natural, I believe. Already. So tell me some of the things you, tell me about Dizzy. What makes up Dizzy? What you like, what you like to do besides play sports, hang out with your family? What's a regular day in the life of Dizzy? Playing a game. What kind of games you like? GTA and oh. 2K and Madden. Okay. Okay. What you play Xbox or you on the PS5? Xbox. You on the Xbox? You any good? Hmm. You any good at it? At Madden? Mm-hmm. Really? Trash. <clears throat> oh, I heard I heard somebody say trash. Who your team? I guess it's Philly. Philly is your team on Madden. Who's your team on Madden? The uh t- Tennessee. Tennessee Titans. Okay. Are you you <laughs> like you like running the ball with Derrick Henry? He ain't he any good on Madden? Mm-hmm. Oh, you can't beat Gunnar Measy? I can. You can beat him. You done beat him before? Mm-hmm. No. Oh. <laughs> Have you ever, um, do your parents ever let you play online? Mm-hmm. Really? Okay. That's a good little thing now, too, because you can make money from that. Yeah, you can. You know, you being famous, what's that website called? Uh, Twitch. Twitch. You can record those games and 
put them games on there and little kids will see you playing that game. I, I heard of a dude named uh, T Grizzly. Mm -hmm. He's from Detroit. Yeah. He's got a Twitch account. His Twitch account makes over two hundred thousand dollars a month. Ooh, okay. Just playing games. Just playing games. So you being a rapper, a famous rapper, I just showed you how many how many streams you got. You ain't no ordinary rapper. You active. You active now, man. So you you might as well keep rapping. You know what I'm talking about? So keep rapping, keep doing your thing because you can the start. I keep saying, man, the sky's the limit. You know what I'm talking about? So tell me about kick. I want you to tell me about a day. You, you, you ain't playing games all day. You have a mom cleaning up. You have kids. Tell, tell me about a day in the life of Dizzy. I'm going to stop talking. Going outside playing. Oh. Just laying down. Playing games with my siblings. Already. You got any um, You got any animals at home? You got a dog? Yes. What kind of dog do you like? You got over there? Micro, micro, micro bully. Oh, you got a micro bully already. Is it a girl or a boy? A uh, girl. Okay, okay. You've been having that 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 dog for a while. Okay, yes, that might have some puppies, huh? Mm -hmm. My wife just slid something else over here. Mm -hmm. Goodness, is this another one? Mm -hmm. Somebody else, a Say, look here, brother. You super famous. Doing your thing. Yeah, you platinum. I was just talking. They proved to me that, you know, what, in nowadays terminology, you know what these is called? Receipts. <laughs> Mom, they hit me with the receipts, man. You got over 400, almost 500,000 on one site. You got over 541K on this site. How does that feel? Good. You the math, That's man. That's a good feeling. That's over a million. That's a good feeling. That's a good feeling right there, man. Hit me with that sign again. I ain't gonna stop, bro. I ain't gonna stop. I ain't gonna stop till I see you on the stage like the first time I saw Lil Wayne on stage. Let me tell you something. I, my wife and I were together. I said, baby, this little boy is a superstar. Yeah. Anytime you can fill up the American Airlines Center where the Mavericks play, you know where the Mavericks play? You ever seen that building? That big building that built right off the freeway. You probably seen it before. Okay. Yeah, bro. Anytime you can fill up that building, you're a star. Mm -hmm. And I see that for you. Major. I see that for you. Just keep writing, bro. Tell me yeah. some more about yourself. Uh, I wanted to rap when I was like six. Okay. But... I, I kept freestyling, just playing with it, and then until so I was 10 and he showed me the studio, Yes, I was like, I want to rap. Oh, so you had already been uh, practicing. Oh, now that yeah, makes that's sense. What's that's that's what that's really what's up. Already. Yeah, I'm so, like, he real good. Just be, be just starting. Okay. I'm about to say, yeah. Put you, some time in. That's you're 10 about. now. When you going to be 11? Some months. This year, 2023? Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Huh? You can tell me birthday, bro. Nah, you can just say the month. Tell yeah. us the month. July. Hey, July. man, you, you better right. put your birthday out there. Some, somebody might cash you up you some on your birthday. When you're famous, people just, just throw stuff at you, man. I'm talking about girls with a dollar in your account. Just think of a million people put one dollar in your account. Whew. They don't need to know how they. What, birthday? Yeah. They don't know it's real name. They know. Tell them July. That's good enough. Oh, it's in July? Yeah. What that is, Scorpio Council? Cancer. You're a Council? Okay. I mean, I'm a Pisces. Water sign. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? You got some questions for Mr. Dizzy? Oh, yeah. So, when you go to the studio, what's your favorite thing about recording? You like, like, you like just being behind the mic? You like being all the buttons the and... And like seeing the buttons. Mm -hmm. You have any interest in producing maybe one day? Yes. That's what's up? Yeah. Like the punch in. Do it all. Oh, you a punch in guy? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Well, well that's how they doing it now, Gunner. Well, daddy say he can do a little bit of both. <laughs> punch in guy himself. Daddy say he can. <clears throat> you gonna have to learn to rap like daddy, huh? You know what that is? That's. I'm gonna tell you an old saying somebody used to say all the time. That you could take. 
and this is for a lot of you rappers. Hmm. If you can't rap it at that studio, you ain't gonna be able to perform it. So that's why he can go in there and just rap them songs. The more you can rap it and flow it, when you do your shows, it's easy to rap. It's easy to rap. You're, you're breathing. It's, it's almost like you're talking. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So practice on, listen to dad. I told you, listen to dad. That punching in is cool. But in our day, punching in was to uh, fix a mistake. Now it's a rapping tool, which is, it's okay because the writing, they're just y- y'all are writing in your head. So that's just a little bit, small, small piece of advice. I'm backing daddy on that. Cause I see him kneeling you over being a punching him guy. <laughs> so you gonna try? Mm-hmm. Yeah, okay. try to try to flow them. Put about four five lines together to where you can get up to a whole sixteen. Or uh, how many boys people rapping now? Gun. I'm, I'm old school talking about sixteen. Ain't twelve. This twelve. Uh, we give twelve. And okay. They ca- and they cost. <laughs> <laughs> they, they got a little tag on them. Huh? They got a tag on them. <laughs> yeah, man. It. Hey, man. Yeah. Hey, hey, that's 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 less work for more money. Yeah. Yeah. I know you ain't complaining about that. <laughs> but you, you gotta go hard. Right? Yeah, you do. Yeah, oh, you yeah. better go hard. <laughs> but you, in other words, you know what he's telling you? You can get paid for rapping on other people's albums. You ready for that money? Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. Already. What kind of cars you like? Like. Rolls Royces, Bentleys. That's your that's your dream car. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay. What's your favorite movie? Teen Wolf. Teen, Teen Wolf. Wolf. Really? I used to like Teen. Ain't Wolf. that an old movie? They've redone. Did it they redo time. Teen Wolf? Okay, okay. So which old. one? The old Teen Wolf. That's oh, you like the original? That's what I'm talking about already. I'm trying to... So you got some shout outs, man. You know what shout outs are? Yeah. Shout out to you to all all your supporters and name a couple of people you like to say hello to. Shout out my fans. Always my mom's fans. That's it. Mm-hmm. Man, you gonna if you forget somebody, it might give you a hard time. Mm-hmm. I know some people like that's petty. <laughs> I know some people might be petty. Shout out everybody. everybody. Yeah. <laughs> and this is a good thing to remember. You might can't remember it now, but go back and listen. See, if I forgot somebody, charge it to my head like you forgot. And don't charge it to my heart because I, I didn't mean it. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? So that's something that you can say when you're giving your shout outs. Because when somebody puts you on the spot, like, give, give some shout outs, you got to, oh, yeah, you might forget about somebody. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, sir. Already, yes, sir. man. I can't wait to hear that next song of yours. What's the name of it again, Gunner? Uh, what, about what about me? What about me? What's that song about? What's that song about? Us. Boosie. Oh, that song was about Boosie? Nah, it was made by Boosie. We, yeah. He just redid it. Okay, okay. okay. So, but it's about just him just trying to get up. I read it. Him being young, trying to come in the music game, but he's telling his life actually. I read it. Oh, cool, I like it. I read it. I'm excited to hear it, man. Me too. Well, I'm glad you had that hat tilted up like that, so I I, I keep forgetting about it. But every time you put it down, <laughs> I see it again. I wish I'd have known you was an Eagle fan. I'd have had some Dallas Cowboy stuff up here. Look at him. He said, "Look at that." Ah, oh, he flexing on me. <laughs> Let's see it again. Man, I appreciate you coming through, bro. Yeah. Man, I want to tell everybody in the world, this is Dizzy. Yeah. I done said it before, this man got good, good stock. You know what I'm talking about? Good blood going through his system. And the man's got a lot of talent. So I need y'all to support him. Y'all support the, the platform. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. We're going to keep coming with this serious content. This is this man's first interview. Mm-hmm. The first time he was on any kind of platform, he went platinum. That's all I'm saying. The first time he was on anybody platform, he went platinum. So we're going to go try to go diamond on this one, okay, man? You know what diamond is? Ten times platinum. All right? That's what we shooting for, man. I appreciate you coming, all right? Yeah. Salute.
Know I'ma get some game tuned in with super tight. Yeah, I get the low love from Big Bobo from the front seat, not no photos. 